So what we've done so far is we've understood that we have policies. We've understood that we're going to send letters and we're understanding that we need to have sufficient expertise. When you hire an expert, ask that expert, listen, have you ever done a disaster claim before? How many estimates have you written? How much experience do you have in this area? If you're going to hire a lawyer, go to the lawyer. How many disaster claims have you handled? Okay? I was in a room a month ago where they put 170 public adjusters in the room and the guy said, everybody who's done a disaster claim, raise your hand. Two out of 170 raised their hand and they were from Florida. Okay? So understand, this is a new storm up here. It's not to say that public adjusters can't do their job or lawyers can't. It's just that this is your house and your life. Make sure you have the most talented people to help you because they usually cost about the same thing. Understand in terms of costs, most of these types of people, whether they're lawyers or public adjusters, what they do is they charge a contingency. A public adjuster might say, I'll, pay five to, I'll take 5 to 10% of what I get for you. What's the good news about that? Well, it's a lot lower than a lawyer fee, and that public adjuster may be very capable and be able to get you money. What's the downside? Well, the downside is they can't sue. So the insurance company knows that, and I'm telling you, I've been on the other side. They know that, so there may be a limit to what they can get. Again, if they document the claim well, then they may have as much power as a lawyer. What's the benefit and drawback of a lawyer? Well, great, you have a lawyer. He can sue if he's experienced, or she can sue if they're experienced, and they will generally front all those costs for you. They will pay all those engineering and expert fees because they have an interest in getting that money. Downside, they are higher. They charge 15 to 30 percent. Okay? You just have to decide for yourself what you think is best. But whoever you hire, whatever you do, whether you do this on your own or not, make sure that you have these talented people who are helping you to do this because it's the difference between getting your claim paid or not.